Michael worked every day and every night, ensuring that all he did was right. He toiled away till he fell asleep, and in the morning took the next great leap. The papers piled up till he was drowned, yet he worked himself out without a frown. He pushed harder than any around him, willing to put himself out on a limb. Nobody applied himself like he did, because they were impotent and unfit. They had checked all of the required marks, but lacked any imaginative spark. They were in the right schools and the right clubs, and the right people's elbows did they rub. Their parents had money and great power, whose projects, with their wealth, they would shower. One day, something that he had created with another was associated. Someone else took the credit for his work, while everything Michael said went unheard. He had been stabbed in the back and ignored. Nobody wanted to give him support. They used Michael to carry out their plans, thinking he'd still accept their commands. But when Michael didn't follow their orders, because they were liars and distorters, he was, at first, reprimanded in turn, but then he was fired and his work burned. They said that his work wasn't good enough, telling him he was too manly and tough, that he needed to just accept the deal, give in to their demands, to bend and kneel. They had exclaimed that their demands were fair and that it was upon him to have shared. He had no money to resist their claims, and so he was pushed to accept his fate. Even after he left, his name was dragged, and any remark that he had made was gagged. Michael had no way to fight his way out. In great pain, he began to scream and shout. Though his work was superb, nobody cared. They simply looked at him, chortled and snared. Those that he worked with had slandered his name, calling him foolish, vicious, and insane. He'd been blacklisted from his industry, all by the hands of some cruel elites who wanted to use his work for their gain, ignoring all of his hard work and pain. Then, he was sent into isolation, and he was given no compensation. Michael was forgotten and alone, losing all of his wealth and his sweet home. He had been the victim of corruption, for he spoke truth and caused a disruption. <laughs>